Three pol police officers from Santa Ana, California were charged yesterday for smashing surveillance equipment and eating food from the employee break room during the raid of the Sky High Dispensary in May 2015. Miss Mary Jane's whoopie pies. <laughs> yeah. Two of the officers, Jorge Arroyo and Nicole Lynn Quijas, are facing a maximum of six months in jail and a $1,000 fine. And Officer Brandon Matthew Sontag is looking at 18 months in jail and a $2,000 fine for petty theft and misdemeanor vandalism count for smashing the cameras. Now, the DA's office stated yesterday that the marijuana edible which the officers have been accused of eating were actually Mrs. Thinster's cookies and a detour protein bars, which they had taken from the employee break room. Oh, and crap. That, and that there was no evidence to show any officers had ingested edibles, though an attorney for the dispensary stands by allegations that the officers did not eat them, stating that just because some were consuming regular food products does not mean they were not consuming Bull edi edibles. Bullshit. Bull <laughs> crap. Who the... Hold on, man. Hold on. Now, Who I goes in and does a freaking police raid, right? You're doing a federal raid, mm -hmm. and you're going to stop to have a bowl of macaroni and cheese. Uh, you could see them eating the Miss Mary Jane's whoopie pie. You could see it. The brand is right there. It's Miss Mary Jane on the cover. She's waving at you and winking a little bit at the cop, and mm -hmm. he shoves it in his mouth, and they're commenting as they're eating the edibles. I, yeah, one of them said something about eating the food and said, yeah, well, yeah you feel kind of lightheaded. But I did look, watch the video yesterday and today, and he, he is eating a protein bar. One of the cops is eating a protein bar in one of the shots. Yeah, he's eating a medicated protein bar because I can't, who, I goes, can't vouch for that. who goes into a raid and goes in, first of all, all, common sense is you don't eat anything out mm -hmm. of a marijuana shop, especially if you're anti-marijuana. Don't drink the water. Don't do anything. There's no way he brought a protein bar in his pocket enough for everybody. Well, no, there was. They were saying there was uh, food in the break room that was for the employees, and they were eating that. Yeah, that's bullcrap. Yeah, yeah. that's a bullcrap. That's so. a bullfaced lie, uh, which that pisses me off because. Uh, you know, the raids alone are one thing, but when the cops don't believe in what they're doing as well, mm -hmm. uh, it's a joke. And I don't know that um, it being an edible or not actually matters in this case, because they're either way, they're getting petty theft charges on them. Right, because they stole out of a They stole out of the dispensary, but, even but if it's I just a little bit of food. But I want to know where's the drug charge that they're pushing onto the co-op? How come the it, cops it are was, now are not uh, considered as, what would you call them, uh, Co cooperating, cooperating people. You know, if I know about you robbing a bank, mm -hmm. then I'm going to jail for robbing a bank too. So if they're in there busting a co-op for a DEA raid and they're participating in the drugs, if that was cocaine and a cocaine bust, and you watch the cops mm -hmm. sniffing that coke while he was doing it, which is same abuse oh, yeah. of power, definitely. Uh, you would be looking at more than six months, which turns into what three weeks on good behavior, community service. They're let off with everything, mm -hmm. right? But you know. Regardless of all that, this is what they're facing right now. Six months in jail, $1,000 fine, and the guy who smashed the cameras is facing uh, 18 months in $2,000 fine. For what? Smashing cameras? They do that at every raid. It's protocol. That's what That's what his charge is? Mm -hmm. So now how come they're not getting charged everywhere else? We Petty got theft and misdemeanor vandalism count. They hundreds say of hours of footage of cops smashing surveillance systems, ripping them out of the ceiling. I have mm -hmm. photos of my co-op where they yanked them out of the ceilings, and you have ceiling tiles all over the floor. I'm guessing not as many people pursue them like this has been. I mean, they knew it was coming, and they're saying it was in a... A uh, unlicensed dispensary, but they knew it was coming. That's why they set up the other cameras to catch them doing what they knew would go on. When and it did, obviously, yeah. they caught it on camera. Good, <laughs> exactly good. what you happened. Know, what also, they were expecting. They were. They were. They should have put a chit in if they were going to be taking lunch, which apparently that's what he did during the middle of the raid. Now you're defrauding the taxpayer by. Yeah, because we're still paying for, for your time. Right. right. He should have been, you know, put a chit in for his lunch. I mean, if he's eating. Police officers don't. Well, they do eat donuts, I suppose. <laughs> I hear it's That's uh, a myth. Bagels are the PC thing now. <laughs> That's a myth. <laughs> bagels. Uh, That's the, the new donut. Well, big shout out to Miss Mary Jane's Edibles and Pete over there. Yeah, uh, so we'll, they're uh, going to be arraigned on April 11th, but they've been, of course, the uh, standard. Uh, uh, paid administrative leave. And How about drug them. test them? How about that? Let's let's that, give them a piss test. It stays in their system for thirty would, days. That would uh, not even part of the protocol. There, <laughs> not even your your employee is seen on camera allegedly doing drugs, quote unquote. Mm -hmm. You should minimally be drug testing them. Minimally, right away, right away, within twenty four hours, like any mm -hmm. other job or anywhere else you work. The twenty four hours to put that pee in the cup. Because now it's too late for that, but... Um, yeah, lucky for them. Right. Yeah, well, they tried to sue people for just uh, watching it. Like, they wanted to sue saying that was our private yeah. business, and how dare you watch us do our drugs. 
How dare you catch us doing what we're not supposed to do? Yeah, Miss, well, I, well, that's your fault. All man. I know is I'm shocked and and just and dif- disbelief that our police would lie. I just <laughs> Get I just here. find yeah. that terrible. So tired of that crap. <laughs>